Hey guys, welcome back. It's been like a half a month or something. I'm not sick anymore, I don't think. At least I don't sound sick to personally myself. If I do, then oh. Uh, but yeah, I. <coughs> as a heads up, I do have a little bit of a cough still. But for now, I should be good. I'm just letting get into the recording booth again. And I've even made some changes, but I can't do anything because it's FA channel tonight. I thought it was me, a banner. So we'll see soon enough. I see Fodlin, I see a sword, and I see an update. But I don't, I don't really know. I have, I have stuff. The channel is getting <coughs> a makeover after this, let's just say. And I'm really excited to show it off because I actually worked hard on this in my free time, which is weird because I don't have as much free time as I thought I would. But at the same time, I do. It, I don't know. I just end up doing shit. Like I don't know. I have, I'm, so much happened too. Like, I'm sorry, the new Fire Emblem trailer dropped, like, there's a new game, Toothpaste Chan is real, there's new figures, there's, like, a tea time thing, I think, that came out, there's so much shit that happened while I was gone, I'm like, no, <coughs> I couldn't, but I will say, on FE, I, no, I almost said Encore, that's TMS, Fire Emblem Engage, I'm a little worried, but I'm gonna roll with it. Oh, it's a male artist. Okay, cool. Oh, he. so is he just redoing the book three opening, I guess? Or is that Sharena? I don't remember. It's kind of funny, though, that this book three thing has been so focused on air. And then Leaf's the one that gets, like, the full, like, um, whatchamacallit. CG? Not, not CG. Just animated cutscene. It looks cool, though. I'll give it that. I'm just, ha I'm just happy to be there. Not gonna lie. <laughs> And there is what we thought. Oh, yeah, though. Man. It's crazy just how much news has been happening in Fire Emblem recently. I'm just so happy. That's all I can say. I'm... <laughs> I'm in good vibe mode. Which is good. Because sometimes I feel like I'm a little bit dour in some videos when I'm just feeling dour during the day. But that is not today. I even, like... Even today, like, my free time, I actually worked on the channel. Like, stuff's gonna happen. And it's gonna... Might be a weird chance... <coughs> might be a... Weird thing to see the first time. But after that, it's gonna be great. And I guess we'll see. I mean, it's a new Fire Emblem game coming out. Maybe I should redo what I did and make it like new game specific. But yeah, reactions enhanced. Summoning videos enhanced. Everything else, honestly, kind of shelved because I was. I even made a few episodes of a Shadow Dragon Let's Play. But, um. Life got ahead of me, and I recorded those like a month ago, and finished them a month ago, and I haven't done anything since. So that's probably shelved until I have enough free time. It's Leaf. He sure was giving it his all in that fight. Yeah, was he? That was a battle, huh? She's usually right there by his side. Huh. Man. Now that I can get a better look at him, it seems like he's wearing a different outfit than he was in the video. Are you fucking stupid, Leaf? What do you mean? It's not just his clothes that are different. Did you notice that he has a pretty strange-looking weapon as well? Yeah. It doesn't. It hopefully, it doesn't damage allies. Imbued with special powers. Mm-hmm. I remember Leaf talking about something with Gong Gloat, Hell's successor as ruler of the realm of the dead in Tempest Trials. Can, oh yeah. Maybe that's when he got mm. the weapon. <coughs> Maybe. I'm not this sure. But man, I just want to see what Gong Gloat looks like. Weapon. Cause I feel like He's we given. Rearm what the fuck is a rearmed hero? Arcane weapons and the rearmed heroes who wield them have characteristics that differentiate them from other types of heroes. Also, sorry if you hear any background noise right now. I don't live alone. <laughs> so, Leaf's new weapon is called Arcane Elhuthnir. Uh huh. Looks like a unique weapon skill. Oh, if it yeah, that's a Leaf stat line. Apparently, it can be inherited by other heroes. Really? What? What do you mean it can be inherited by other heroes? I'll pick the arcane weapon. Mm hmm. And C skill. And. See, she's doing the optimizations, which. They need to increase that to five then at this point. <gasps> Faye, I can't believe that he can get it though. Really? Faye, Faye. That's impressive. I, going to disappear, I like that. Right here. That means rearmed hero leaf doesn't leave your barracks, even if you have another hero inherit skills from him. Huh. Ooh, I like that for inheritance. What's this icon? Okay, so basically it's... He gets two uses, I'm guessing. Because he can... Can you still sack him, or is it like... Or he needs to be bloated with him unless he merge him? I feel like... I feel like it's probably like a two-time thing. That's great for skill inheritance, though. 
like, you know. Mm-hmm. You can only have another hero inherit skills from them once. But they don't leave your barracks after having their skills inherited. So you can add them to teams, merge Ooh. them, and... That's a smart idea to merge them, though. Like, get your use out of him, then make him a plus around. one. That's smart. But I... That's though. pretty interesting, though. I kind of like that physical inheritance. I want to see who else gets it. Because I'm a little bit... I'm a little worried for how good their skills are going to be. Like, I feel like... Because it's Faye, they're going to cheap out somehow. It's going to be like, okay, he's... Although, Menace and... What do you have, like, attack push or attack something? Still, though, that'd be that... That's good. What's this? No, he has the attack other one that, like, Byleth has. Really? So I can re- I can refine arcane whatever that word is, but I can't refine a brave weapon. Make it sense, sense. What's in the celebration? Because I might need these orbs. Because, uh, my per I don't even have to describe this. My personal account is gone. Like, um, the Fae, like, the one I'm doing on YouTube? Erased. Because, like, I had to reboot my system. So, and that kind of went with it with blue stacks. So, yeah. I'm kind of at square one again. Which is a little bit infuriating, because I was so close to plus sitting up to barn, but... Eh, I just had to take the punches as is. That happened a few days ago. I already recouped mentally from it. But I did have to play a lot of book one, just to get all my shit together. Uh, okay, maybe life hasn't all been sunshine and rainbows. But... You know what? I need to go find more information to share. I, you know, I don't even know a good way to spin on this. Also, I was saying this is the first time using OBS on this system. Um, as a heads up, my this might be a bit of a different quality, the video itself, than you expect, because I don't know how to do that off the top of my head, because I just went to the default settings, which hopefully should be fine enough. Also, I fully ignored what the fuck this was. Oh! Oh, really? I'm surprised that we got one from from three hopes because I see what Monica Holst I have not used Monica like I didn't play um I only played Golden Wildfire and then I kind of gave up because the not gonna lie the end of Golden Wildfire I was not happy with I was not happy with that game at all for the story but you know it's cool that we get to use Monica I feel like I should like if I'm gonna play the game again like I feel like I do this this route because that's like pretty cool also, I wonder... Yeah, no, she seemed very lesbian for her. The, 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 the 180 people had on her, it was wild. People were like, they she was their BFF one minute, and then they weren't the next. I don't know if his chin is really long, or his mouth is really, like, derpy. But he's like, ooh. It's almost like the, like... The Animal Crossing, like the cat one, that's like a three to me. I don't know why. Very wholesome. I will say, though, I think that's actually one that I did get on camera that I uploaded. I uploaded like one episode, and um, per usual, like with the original three heads that I did, it just wasn't working out for me. But Holst was really fun, and the fucking gag when he was playable. I was like, I was blown the fuck away. It was, it was epic. I loved it. Holly Jolly Hilda. I love Hilda. Hilda's great. Also, I love that pose. It's so dynamic. You better work, bitch, or not. Probably not. That's true. This is the first time that we've had a non-brave post-skip unit. Out of, like... She's doing the hell the hell the. See, I love doing that one too. I don't blame her. I'm always ready to head into battle. So I wonder if Arval has a chance then of like actually appearing now. Because honestly, with three hopes, because like the original Warriors games never had characters. Not gonna lie, it's like they're slimmer than I thought they would be in Fey. But I'm okay with that. Also, I like what they did with the hair. The hair doesn't feel as like flat. It, it helps with the coloring, like, I feel like male Shez look better than female Shez art-wise. Given, they both look great, but like, you know, is he my favorite design in the world? No, but he's okay. Like, I, I think Heroes, he works better in 2D than he is in 3D, I guess is a great way to put it. Because, you know, you can kind of tell who's a 2D character who's a 3D character sometimes, like, when they're actually drawn out. Like, in Final Fantasy and shit like that, like, you know, those... Final Fantasy VI characters, <clears throat> those are never being made in 3D. Like, those are never been conceived before, it's just easier to do in 2D. So, but I don't know, I feel like Shadows looks just better standing still than he does 
Also, is the female one three? Really? Oh. I'm surprised the male one's on the banner. Although I do wonder with um the form of souls or whatever the fuck it's called. Um, actually not the form. Actually, what kind of form? The resonant battles are they going to be concluded as three houses units, three hopes units? Because we think about three hopes units now in these, in the rotation. Uh oh, that's going to be fun. Shezzes, Shezai. But man, I'm glad the new game gets representation. Because I like Three Hopes fine enough. It was like, it's a Warriors game, so you know what you're getting into, but the supports were really good. I was surprised consistently with how the supports were, like, actually well meaning. Like, they were nice. I love them. It's information on the next version update. I know it's a bit early, but I'm going to introduce October 4th. You can look forward to in October. Uh huh. First up. Is the Hall of Forms. Really? The Hall of Forms announcement? It seems the Hall of Forms will be getting event revivals. That means you'll have another chance to make Forma you missed out on from past events. Oh, yeah, I can get Bride Sheeta and Doga. These are the heroes of the Tokyo Mara sessions. The first time around. You know, Let's take a closer look. I'm like 80% they can see of this because they never gave Tokyo Mara sessions another hey. banner. There are also skills that didn't appear the first time the event was held. It, that's a it's rude skill. So I, want my forma to learn. I mean, to be fair though, I love Token Raw Session. When are we getting a banner for that, by the way? I've been waiting patiently, and I've gotten nothing. Where's Token Raw? Okay, I will say, I will start. I am speaking as since now. I will be starting the revolt when it comes. When Choose Your Legends next comes out, we're voting for Itsuki and Toma. Why? Because they were top ten last time, and I think it'd be funny if they won CYL, so you can just force a TMS banner out there. What's happening? Moving right along. I, was, I was looking at the camera, just f world. fighting, being like, they're Start getting into Fey. They're gonna win Choose Your Legends. We're getting Brave Tom more you like it or not, and I will start this fight ne this next year. I, people have started it before me, and I'm gonna fucking end it. This is the fun mode, though. I did like this one a lot. Honestly, that was just... It will be easier than ever to increase your favor level. What are you... I don't play this mode because it's stupid, but... Okay, so you just get more points. Cool. Oh, it's a bonus period. Huh. Plus... You'll be able to choose the level 40 no support custom rule in favor battles as well. The skills you use and the moves you make will be of the utmost importance. I can tell. Okay, I don't know much about PvP modes, but <coughs> I, didn't even, I didn't even know supports were a thing that was like involved. Huh. That's it for today, summoners. Is it? I can't believe I got to introduce a new type of hero. And I can't believe I got to introduce myself to the world again. I feel like I was like half just mentally like recouping my the insanity and then also watching the video. But I will say, I mean, it's nice. I'm glad. That, I'm just surprised three ha three hopes got in, but I'm glad it did because you know, especially for the characters. You know, Monica seemed nice enough. I never actually read her supports. I didn't play her out. Hulk was really cool though. Although apparently I locked myself out of his B support by not doing a C support early enough or something. So I never got to see his A support. I couldn't see all of them thanks to that. Thanks, Claude. For being weirdly specific, probably because of the lo the plot of the game, which I will appreciate, because I know if he's not into this, like Path of Radiance, supports actually changing as the game goes along. I know some games that happens, like I think Nino supports change depending on the status of how everyone is doing, aka like how alive they are. Um, but yeah, it's really nice. Well, I hope that we all like the units. I think we all. It's three houses, and it's the recent game, so I feel like they'll, they're going to be liked. Like, I think this is going to be, for some people, a slam dunk banner. Like, I can see people loving this. Also, sh it's good they're color sharing, I guess is a good way to put it. Yeah. I don't know. I'm, I'm just kind of surprised with how they actually look in 2D, because I don't like Shez's design, like, at all. But they don't look that bad compared to, like, 3D Shez. I think it might just be the artist, too. Like, kind of really playing into the um the fire aspect of it but yeah okay i'll take it i mean i'll be summoning the spare anyways because i have orbs i need to spend and a shit ton of them so <laughs> that's you know my stance on that but anyways i'll see you guys next time like comment subscribe bye